one thing that you have never experienced in your life is a loss. You're undefeated throughout your career. But now you have some fighters, your friends, your cousins, your brothers. They, most of them win most of the time, but some of them lose. How do you help them during their loss? Because the community has never seen you lose, but you're seeing them lose. So what is the mindset after a loss? We see the mindset after you won. What is the mindset after someone loses? Oh, this is uh, this is all about fighting. If he's like mentally he's weak, uh, doesn't matter. Even if he's gonna win, uh, he's gonna change. This is all about mental. Sometimes it's like when fighters lose, this is better for him than he win. Uh, this is because it's not all about all all the time winning. But when fighters lose, though, all I can say, I tell him you have to fix your mistakes and come back stronger. You know, it's like just uh, calm down, stay relaxed. If you're gonna keep training hard, your time is will come. You, know, you, you have to be patient because uh, in this game, it's most important thing is to be patient. You have to be patient. This is first. And only second, it's become hard work. You know, it's like patient is the key. Well, that's good. If there is something special, this cannot be argued as a fact. There is something special about people from Dagestan. You know, these people are not only you, but many years before you, they were fighters and they are athletes. What makes these fighters from Dagestan so special? Not just grappling, not just striking, but overall, whatever they do, what makes it special? Is it the food in Dagestan? Is it the weather in Dagestan? Is it the parents of Dagestan? What is it? I think, uh, I think it's location, where we have location. Pakistan location, when we look at this, this is uh, door between Asia and Europe. And um, last 1,000 years, in Pakistan all the time was war, if you watch. And that's why people are so tough. And uh, if you talk about us, like fighters, and uh, I think you can watch anybody who become Success, who's very good fighter from Pakistan. Like they all was very, you know, they all come from poor life and they all was very hungry. Like you can watch, you can like, for example, like Islam, myself, Zabid, Ankalai, like anybody you can watch, like who's on high level, they all was very poor. They don't even have food, food enough to eat. And I think it's uh, all about this. And, and of course, system. It's very, we have very good system. Uh, like we have very good coaches in Pakistan. Very, very good. When I talk about very good, I mean that like they are best in the world. Not only in Pakistan or Russia or Europe. I mean like all around the world. Like, you know, how many billion people here? Like 8 billion, they are best. Can you imagine? It's like 8 billion people in the world. I mean, I mean our coaches, I don't, I don't mean only my father, I mean like we have very, very good coaches, they are not famous like my father, but they are very good coaches. When you have good coaches, good system, training system, and you have hungry and uh, very powerful young generation, it's to become fighter is like, uh, you don't need to be special, this is what I think, you know, and uh, but right now, when we see it's like uh, when you have very good gym, you have money, you have everything, it's like on this kind of things when you have, it's very hard to become champion. You have to be hungry. If you fool, why you have to train? It's like very simple.